Hi, Gemini. How are you? My name is Diana, Intuitive D1111 here on Instagram. I'm in Intuitive D E E 11 underscore 11. And right now, I want to let you guys know that I have a new Etsy shop. So instead of me doing my personal readings through other platforms, I am going to be, um, you know, also doing some through Etsy. So if you want to save 25%, then go ahead and book a personal reading with me. Um, the link is going to be in the um, description box down below. Okay, so let's go ahead and see. So the first card out we have for you, Gemini, is I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. Mastery, you've learned the spiritual lesson. So, I mean, whatever connection you are in with your person, um, for some of you, you guys had a lot of karma to clear from a past life. For others of you, um, you both triggered each other into learning a lot. Um, for some of you, the cycle with this person has already closed. Okay, your feelings of your person towards you in this connection, Gemini. What do they want to tell you? What's going on here? Oh, new love. So a new love or recommitment to love is developing. So I see that as the Ace of Cups. So for some of you, that's an indication that you have a new love that's coming in. So congratulations. Out with the old, right? You cleared that cycle, someone new coming in. Or for some of you, um, you could have cleared a karmic cycle with your person. And then you have... Um, a new start coming, right? Okay, so Gemini, how is your person feeling for you right now? We have, I love you. Woo, your person's in their feelings. I love it, Gemini. Okay, and then bottom of the deck we have is chemistry. So the attraction you feel is mutual. Love it. Okay, so, and for some of you, I'm getting that this person, it might not even been a karmic cycle that they closed with you. They could have closed this karmic cycle with somebody else. So they could have had, um, you know, just take it as it resonates. Because, of course, this is a general reading, right? So just apply what resonates. But we're going to go ahead and clarify with the tarot. Um, but definitely this person has a lot of love for you. So that's beautiful to see. Okay, so let's go ahead and clarify. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson for Gemini's watching this connection. Look at this. Two of cups again. This person feels that you are their person. Um, and for some of you, it took them going through a bad karmic connection for them to realize this, right? Can we clarify mastery? You've learned the spiritual lesson for Gemini's watching this video and their person, please. Why is that here? Okay, we have the Seven of Cups. Yeah, I really feel like for a lot of you guys, this person left you confused, right? Um, for a lot of you guys, you know, you have other options and they see this and this makes them nervous. There are others of you, though, where your lesson was to not be treated as an option, right? Your lesson was to know your worth and to realize, hey, you know what? If someone doesn't want to take the time and grow a connection with me, right, move things forward with the eight of wands at the bottom of the deck um, to have this mutual connection, then I need to close this cycle out because clearly this person has not seen my worth, right? So let's go ahead and clarify this new love energy. What's this about? Nave of Nave of chalices. So this is like the page of cups. And you see, there's a cup. I shouldn't be laughing at this. This is wrong. But anyways, the reason why I am laugh, laughing is because I feel like this person waited so long, right? I feel like this person is worried about you and someone else right now. You see another couple out there. I feel like this person has struggled to communicate with you. And I feel like they're struggling. Some of them, some of them are afraid you have a new love. I'm just going to put it out there like that. Others of them are, they're struggling to convey their feelings to you. You see how he is scrunching up the paper. Like he literally is mad at what he is writing. So your person could have a blocked throat chakra. Um, so definitely, you know, if you're on a twin connection, you can go ahead and heal that. That'll help your counterpart. But even so, I feel like your person for some of you, these feelings kind of hit this person out of the blue and they don't really know how to feel about it, like how to go about it. Because I don't know that they were necessarily expecting to feel the way that they do. But look, we have all cups here. So we have all emotions here, right? With a little bit of fire underneath the deck. Oh, well, we had some. Now we have the queen of cups, which is more, which is more um, emotions energy, right? 
So your person has a lot of love for you. So let's go ahead and clarify I love you, right? Let's see what's going on with this connection then. Because they have all these emotions for you, but it's like out of everyone that they've been with or they ventured off with or that had their eye, it's like they're realizing you're their person, but it's like they're having a hard time communicating this. So what's this I love you about in the chemistry? Let's go ahead and clarify that for Gemini, how their person is feeling for them. I love this energy for you because it's like either way, even if you're like, you know what? Nope, they're my ex. I'm not taking them back. It's like you're going to be blessed with somebody new that's really going to love you and show you love. And this is like, this is like someone, um, if this is a new person, this is someone where it's going to lead to some, for some of you, I'm hearing to an engagement for others of you. It's like, it's going to lead to something that's going to develop in more. It's like the into more. It's like the butterfly feelings that you get, right? We have the eight of cups here. Okay. So for some of you, it's like you have to leave something behind to get this new love, right? For others of you, this person you're connected with, there could have been something karmic in their life that they had to leave behind for them to be able to come and have this connection with you. And they feel bad for how, you know, they've treated you with the five of cups. I mean, this is all cups. This is insane, guys. You guys have somebody in their feelings. So let's go ahead and clarify. So we have the Eight of Cups. What's this about? What is the Eight of Cups about? Some of you guys, this is you walking away from this person. And you're like, nope, you had your chance. You know, I waited forever. I'm not going to do that again. Nunca mas. You know what I mean? Um, okay, so what is... Let's go ahead and clarify this again. Oh my God, another cup card. This is insane, you guys. Six of Cups. So... Yeah, for some of you guys, this is someone from your past that is going to... Now, I can see the Eight of Cups multiple ways. This could be, you know, this person leaving, right? Realizing they made a mistake, right? When they left you, they went somewhere else. For others of you, because the Eight of Cups is him leaving to find his Two of Cups. So he could have left that connection. He wants to come to find a connection with you with the Two of Cups. Some of you guys are leaving this connection with your person, um, because you feel like your two of cups is still out there. So take it how it resonates. Yeah. Because it's like the two of pentacles here. There is a choice that needs to be made. Right. Um, for some of you guys though, this person's keeping a close eye on you. Look at the way he is <laughs> kind of creeping up behind her. I feel your person loves the way you look. They love, you know, your style. They think you're very beautiful or handsome. I feel like you, you invoke a lot of emotions in this person that they're not used to. And I feel like that's something else that, um, that really triggers them or sets them off because they don't understand why it is they feel so deeply for you or why they haven't really let you go after X and X amount of time. So, wow. Be it old or new, you have love. So that's beautiful. I love this for you. Um, if you enjoyed this reading, Gemini, please hit the like button as well as subscribe. That'll help more people to see my videos and help my small channel to grow. And I would really appreciate it. All right. Bye, you guys.